the importance of a marketplace cannot be overemphasized. Not only does buying and selling of goods and services go on in a marketplace, people are also given the opportunity to earn a living and become responsible to themselves and to the society. Apostle Chibuzo, who is never tired of helping people, decided to build an entirely free market. In fact, some time ago, he stated that most of the thoughts that occupy his mind are thoughts of how to save souls and better the lives of people. For Apostle Chibuzo, Every opportunity is an opportunity to put a big smile on the faces of people. At the OPM free market, stores are given out to underprivileged persons for free and a larger number of them started businesses with money given to them by Apostle Shibuzo Gift Chinyiri. Because of the opium free market, some rehabilitated former sex workers and hardened criminals now have opportunities to make legitimate money. Most of the marketers can boast of tangible accomplishments and some of them are even beneficiaries of the OPM scholarship abroad. My name is Evine Chinyere Kelvin. I came to open my, I'm one of the daughters of Dr. Jesus. I came and denounced prostitution in OPM here. I denounced that he rehabilitated me. I passed through the rehabilitation and now I'm married. I got married to one of the pastors in OPM here. People are buying and we are selling. We are selling tiger nuts, zobo and, uh, and fish roll with buns. We sell a lot of things there. We started the market in small proportion, but by the grace of God, we sell now big, we sell in quantity. We sell in people come and buy and enjoy. They love the products. No, we're not paying for the shop. The shop is free. My name is Mrs. Obon, my name is Kelvin. The way I located OPM is through my husband. He came here and denounced of distribution of fake currency. So after the denouncing that he gave us uh, accommodation, we are living in estate seas and gave my uh, children free scholarship. And I also, that he empowered me by giving me money to start up a business. My husband, he promised him to send him outside. And again, my baby that I delivered, I delivered her in OPM free specialist hospital. And more again, this clothes I'm wearing now is our department clothes. Catering, OPM free catering school. So Daddy have been so good to me since we started this since we started this OPM. I've no lack anything. Daddy gave my husband the opportunity to travel to Dubai and as I'm saying now the visa is already out and the the process is at hand so I pray very soon he will be traveling out. I did not pay shishi. Daddy gave me money to start up the business. I never felt any one error. So everything about me is just as in it's just work of God. So I'm so grateful. My name is Brother Anthony. I do not have to handle that issue. When I start to learn it, uh, how to produce time, so uh, begin to make time and I actually know how to choose. Yeah, 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 I begin to start to do my own life. Yes, I live in front of the state. 
Yes, my name is uh, Mr. Kechupu Obobo, popularly known as Ike, as Daddy used to call me. This place actually is given to us free of charge, and we have benefit, uh, benefited a lot from this market. From this market, I can be able to say that my son that is in Turkey today finished uh, in Absu. By the grace of God today, he's in Turkey. And my daughter, the same thing, she finished in Absu University. That is Abia State University. Even at that, the money we are making in this very place is the money I used to train them with. Today, I can be able to say I have three families, extended families, that I use the money I get from this market to help. And today, they are all doing well. I will thank Daddy because these things that he's doing is not easy. In this market today, some has bought car, land, and some other good things. Just like on I, I am saying now that uh, I trained my children to university level, and today, by the grace of God, that they are taking two of my children to abroad to study more and one again staying with him. My name is Mr. Namde Dane Okanwan and we are in OPM Divine Market, Dr. Jesus City, Alo River State, OPM Omega Power Ministry and this is the food venture, the canteen of the headquarter of the Omega Power Ministry in Potapot and we are a beneficiary of uh, one of the canteen stand here in o o Omega Power Ministry. And this canteen belongs to my mom, but I assist her in the consent of running the place as well. This place was given for free to us as the less privileged and as well to help ourselves in life food. It's just a free of charge. This place was built, packaged, and we packed in here by our Dadijio, Apostle Chubuz Wagib Chinyere. And we are very grateful to him, most especially I myself, I'm so grateful and my family, I'm so grateful to him for giving us this great opportunity and this chance. All I can say, may God Almighty continue to bless him abundantly. Wow, it was very funny, like, I don't know how to say it, but all today you can see a smile in my face. That is to show that there is a difference between then and now. Before then, we came in OPM. Life was not like this, but since we came in in OPM, our life has been transformed to a certain stage of I can testify the goodness of God up to this moment. And uh, once again, I'm so grateful to our daddy for giving us such opportunity, for seeing us through in all the point of our needs of our life. My name is Gospar Christopher. Okay, by the grace of God, here was given to me by our daddy Gio in the Lord, free of charge. I'm a chef by profession. I use here to display my talent. As you can see this showcase, I bake all manner of snacks here and people come to buy. And here that I'm staying is free of charge. I'm not paying anything. And God has been using the man of God to bless us in different areas. So by the grace of God, I so much appreciate him. I pray that God should give him strength, give him the grace to continue this good work. Uh, it was not really easy. It was not easy, but God, from here, I was able to stand with my feet. And um, I say, may God continue to strengthen the man of God. He has been a, a source of help to our lives. Sales is better. It's better. Here, we are not running from tax force. We are not running from um, 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 stout on the road. We sell here peacefully, and we go peacefully.
Mrs. Maureen Chukwu, the welfare director of OPM Worldwide. This is our divine market, which was um, commissioned in 2016 for the reasons that he gave to us to house the less privileged, the sons that denounce and their wives, the daughters that daddy picked from the brothels, different brothels of the state, and they power them. And some of them too, who are prostitutes, also came themselves to renounce in the church. And um, after the months of their rehabilitation, now the church has taught them the word of God, changed their orientation about life, give them a new starting of life. And um, we brought some people for seminars to train them on entrepreneur and some of them now choose on the areas where they want to be. Some are in the free skills acquisition and some were also empowered with money to start off their business in this uh, divine market. And I tell you, 80% of those in that market are being powered from the tithes of OPM, tithes and offerings of OPM. And um, by the grace of God, they are doing well. When you enter each of the shop, you see families. It's like a family business. They are all there doing their business properly. And you see people smiling with happiness. The Bible, the, our man of God, there is this word he normally says, he said, don't just give somebody fish. Train them on how to fish. And that's exactly what he has done. And in this market, it's not just a bacha, it's not just an ordinary market. The space there, out there, is 300 and something thousand or 250. And the space there is a wonderful, spacious space. In that market, they have borehole. In that market, they have clean toilet facilities. Um, and other things there. When you go in there, you see that God is faithful. Before we accept to put them in that market, they were sent on health tests, which will run each and everybody that is there today. At least as I'm talking to you, they know their HIV status, they know their hepatitis status and all that. They know their health status. That is by their health now. Then secondly, we have some medical personnel that go there to check what they use to cook. Is the environment clean? Is their kitchen clean? What kind of oil are they using? In fact, I tell you, the oil they use there is cholesterol free. Including the palm oil they use, we also test it to make sure it's not a soured palm oil for those that are into catering. Then for those that are into provisions, we check their ways, whether it has expired, and check the expiry dates. And those of them that are close to expire, we ask them to put them off. I tell you, God is faithful. Nobody has gone into that market and complained one day. And by the grace of God, they are doing well. Our market is free of charge. The space, the money to start, they start off uh, uh, money for the business and all that is all free. And I thank God they are doing well today. Some of them in that market, you see them, they are training their children in the universities. They are no longer burdens to the church. They are doing greatly well. And I say may God continue to reward the man of God. He's a great man. Those of them from the brother does not have the spirit of going back to their la past vomit. The ones that were criminals and their wives are no longer thinking of going to rob people to live. I thank God the man of God has given them life and they are doing greatly well today. We can't help everyone, but everyone can help someone. You never know when a helping hand will change another person's entire life. Partner with Omega Power Ministries to touch more lives and enjoy the blessings that flows in OPM. 
everything that Apostle Chibuzo does for humanity is funded from offerings and tithes.